everyone and welcome back. So first things first, before we jump right into anything, this is not a look you should expect to see from me very often. I never wear my hair up like this, but I just finished filming the beginning of a 10 week review I'm doing for Korean skincare. So if you're interested in Korean skincare, stay tuned for like two months from now because that'll come out. But anyway, before we jump right into the vlog, I would first just like to establish what Chimek is. And Chimek is a combination word from chicken and mekju. And chicken is like the Konglish word for chicken and mekju is the Korean word for beer. So if you combine them, it just means chicken and beer. And it's kind of like a slang term that's used very, very commonly in Korean language. And really, it can mean a lot of different things. It can mean literally like, let's just get chimek, like chicken and beer, go into a restaurant. But I think more commonly, it's used as kind of like an event because it is an event. When you go for chimek or go to chimek or have a chimek, it's usually like a picnic and you go to, I think the most popular place in Seoul to have Chimek is the Han River. You go to the river, you bring a tent and you just sit down and you order chicken and they deliver it to where you are in the river and you just hang out with friends or family with your tent and some drinks and you just have chicken and beer and you just hang out as a group. And it's great. So some of you know who have already watched my videos, I was part of a club while I was at Iwa called Sayo Korea Club and I was in Shinchan Group 3. And this club did a lot of activities and cultural events and one of them was that we went for a chimek. You'll see later in the video that we actually used, um, instead of a tent, newspapers. I called them our peasant blankets and that's what we sat on in the grass. So we were just a group of mixed Koreans and foreigners sitting on newspaper being loud in the grass. So it was approximately a year ago and I remember that so clearly because May 1st, the day where we had our chimek, was also the first day I started dating my boyfriend. It's the last week of April now. Monday is May 1st and it's our one year anniversary. And even though he's not in this video at all, it means a lot to me because it started to get dark and I couldn't film anymore. But after it had gotten dark, he actually came to join us and it meant a lot to me that he traveled like half an hour, I guess, from where he lived to the Han River to come and meet the friends that meant so much to me on literally the first day that we started dating. And one of the club members asked like, oh, Rachel, is this your boyfriend? And I remember just being so shy at the time and not answering her and I kept looking at him and she asked him in Korean and he answered and then everyone like freaked out. And so you won't see Andy at all in this video, but this day was really precious to me because we had so much fun and also it just, I know in my head I'm picturing and envisioning that day and just when he came in the beginning of our relationship and it's just a cute memory for me. Since Andy and I are still in a long distance relationship and will be for about another year more until I finish my degree, I can't film anything special of him for our one year. I'm trying to visit him in June, um, politics and world events permitting. But until then, this is what I have. And it's kind of really great and special to me that I have something that I filmed, such a precious memory from the first day that we started dating as boyfriend and girlfriend. So with that being said, please enjoy this very brief vlog of Chimek with me and my friends playing games and sitting on our peasant blankets and just enjoying the nice spring weather. I went to military training on Wednesday. Oh my god. Yeah, right. Oh yeah, that's what I went. Ha <laughs> 
just with chicken and beer and friends and if you have a tent that's great bring a tent if not you can use peasant blankets and sit on some newspaper but it's just a great time to just spend with friends outside enjoying the warm weather and it's a great memory to me because again as I said that was the first day I started dating my boyfriend and May 1st is our one year anniversary so happy anniversary Andy I love you and um, I guess that's it. So thank the rest of you guys so much for watching again, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.